is. We've got the whole team here. I was actually very impressed that they all decided to wake up so early with us, but they have been on East Coast time for a month, so it's really like 9 a.m. there. Can I give some high fives to you guys? You guys are awesome, 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 awesome. Great job. All right, I'm going to stop here and talk to, to Lewis Lappy. If you have seen that one play that was been playing over and over and over again, the walk-off home run to clinch the title, this was the guy. Has it sunk in yet? Uh, only a little bit, but I'm still uh, getting it to fully absorb. I'm not, I haven't absorbed it yet, but it's, it's just feels great. You know, my favorite part was when you rounded the bases and everybody was there and you guys were just hugging and high-fiving. I mean, that must have been an awesome moment. Yeah, we usually do that after every homer, like kind of on home plate, but this was uh, different because it was like the homer. Yeah. Yeah. You guys worked really hard. I mean, you guys were gone for like almost a month. Like, did you miss home? Did you want to get back or were you just so in the moment? You were like, I'll go as long as this goes. I, I love to play the game, but I did miss my home as well. Yeah. I miss it. Well, you guys came home yesterday. We have some video of the celebration in El Segundo when the team came back. Everybody was lining the streets. What was it like when you were in that motorcade and seeing people out the out the car doors, like, cheering you guys on? It was really cool. Um, we had the same thing in Williamsport, but this was ten times better because it's our hometown. And um, everybody was just happy to see us. And really energized. Well, and it's just the first of many celebrations that you guys are going to have. I want to talk to Coach here. Um, I've been talking to people here in town for the last couple days, and what they were saying is that you guys had a really hard road. I mean, tell me about the work that everybody put in and the heart and determination they put in to get this victory. Yeah, so it's really hard to come out of the uh, state of California. The teams are just so good, and here you can play baseball all year long with the weather that we have. So, um, there's really good teams, and you know, with the coaching staff that we have, with Eddie Lee and Tim Abrams and myself, we make the kids work hard, but we just don't make them work hard. We make them work hard to get better, not just come out and work and work and work. So we go back to the little things that they did when they were eight and nine years old so they still get their footwork in and uh, still get the right movements and, and keep that going. So you know, these kids deserve all the credit in the world. They came out. They worked hard every day when we asked them to. Um, and when you play as a family in a team sport, it's really hard to lose. Yeah, you guys made everybody so proud, not just in El Segundo. I think everyone around Southern California was cheering you guys on. So tonight, you get to go to Dodger Stadium, take part in pregame festivities. How are you feeling about that? Is that something that you get to go do that? Yeah, well, I'm excited about one particular thing. I kind of want to meet Freddie Friedman because he's my favorite MLB player and he's on the Dodgers. So... Hopefully I get the opportunity. Well, to that's meet. why you're saying it right now. Freddie, come out before the game. I mean, I know he's got work to do tonight, too. But, yeah. you know, from champ to champ, now you guys have something in common, right? Yeah, yeah, we could talk about that, you know. Well, good. Thank you guys so much. I, I have to let them get back. So here's the one thing I want to tell you. They were all eating donuts over there. And I was like, can you put down your donuts to talk to us? So thank you, thank you for that. I'll let you get back. We're going to check in with them again in an hour and talk more of these guys because, oh, my gosh, what an amazing thing they've done. We're all so proud. You guys are awesome. Right now I'm going to let them go eat because uh, it is still a little bit early again this morning, guys. <laughs> it is a very early time for them to wake up, and we take the food away too. Tina, oh, thank right. you. <laughs>